Hey, before we dive into how we solved Homer's food aggression, I want to make a few things absolutely clear. I actually posted this video and took it down because I felt I wasn't giving enough background on the technique, why I decided to apply it to Homer's training, and to let everyone watching to be very careful and exercise caution if you're planning to try this on your dog. First, I'm not an expert nor a professional. This is by no means an instructional dog training video on how you should treat food, food aggression. So please, do your own research or learn from a pro. Secondly, this method should only be done on very young puppies. The person I learned this technique from was demonstrating on puppies that couldn't have been more than one month old. Attempting this on an adult dog with a long history of food aggression would be outright dangerous. We adopted Homer at four months old. Now, I was comfortable using the method when I observed aggression during his normal feeding time with kibble or wet food. He was small, teeth were like needle pins, and if he did bite, it probably wouldn't have done too much damage. Now that he's six months and we raised the stakes by introducing bone and red meat, his natural carnivore instinct went into overdrive and the aggressiveness kicked back in. I still felt comfortable continuing the method because he was used to it and we were able to de desensitize him greatly. However, again, at six months old and with the full rack of near adult teeth, I was taking a risk. So I would still be careful trying this on older puppies, especially with the bigger breeds. Lastly, there are tons of resources on this subject with various techniques and methods. We chose what was best for Homer and us only after doing extensive research and getting different opinions. So let me reiterate, do your own research. Be extremely careful and always seek advice and help from the pros. With all that said, here's how we solved Homer's food aggression. Thank you for listening and tuning in. Cheers. Turns our sweet little puppy into like this Just let him keep there. Just keep. He needs to just get used to you. Just put him by his head. Good boy. Good boy. You're such a good boy. What'd you give him? Bone. That's bone marrow. That yeah. is a um. Yeah, it's a bison bone. Mm. Raw bison bone. 
I ain't loved it. And they don't recommend you do it until they have all their adult teeth, but he has all of his adult teeth, so. Yeah. Yeah. Nice set. Yep. Nice grill, Homer. Nice grill. All right. He seems okay. I want to leave him on a good note. He's not growling. gonna take your bone. All right. There you go. Relax. Relax. Yeah, sure, good boy. That's a good boy. Relax. Yeah, boy. Now he knows we're not gonna take his bone and he feels good doing that near us. There you go. Come Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, go. Go change the book.